Hi, I'm Chuck. And I'm Nancy. We're at a point in our lives where we have the opportunity to give back. It's been a dream in the making for several years, and now it's amazing that we are approaching the launch of King's Kids Africa. When we first arrived in a rural village of Uganda, children came running from every direction to greet us. A few younger ones were reluctant because for them, it was their first time to see a Mazunga, a white person. But they quickly warmed up. So many children, but we wondered, where were their parents? Five-year-olds were in charge of babies, carrying them on their backs all day. Many chewed on corn cobs that were dirty and old, and all were barefoot, and most were dressed in rags. At first I thought how sweet they were to greet us, but it soon became obvious that they were actually starved for attention. Their tummies were probably empty too, but their biggest need was for someone to notice them. How could we help but notice them? Those precious faces and those big brown eyes looking up at us. We were smitten, and then we were saddened when we learned that we were in the midst of orphans. Looking back, we can see how God has shaped us for this ministry. As young teens, Nancy and I would visit the border towns and orphanages of Mexico, and through my work, I have traveled and built projects around much of the world. We are humbled that God has called us to care for the neediest of His children in Uganda, children who are not sure where their next meal has come from and have nobody to love them. It is these we have a passion to serve. This year, we are planning to build four orphan homes. Each home will house eight children and a house mother. Just think, that is 32 children who have lived off the streets with little food and no one to love them. Now, these children will get to know the life-transforming power of God's love, along with the comfort and security of a loving home. Believe me, that's life-changing.